Welcome back everyone, it's Sylvia from Aussie Scrapper. Today's video is a haul that I'm going to share with you from Casercraft. I went to Canberra to visit some relatives and even though it was a long drive, on the way back home I stopped at Casercraft and had a look at their store and my gosh, I can't wait to go to Canberra again. The main thing I bought and the reason why I went to Kaiser Craft was that I wanted these paper holders to put into my Kalex unit here at home. I will add that they're working wonderfully and holding all my paper and I can now access my paper a lot quicker so I'm really happy. Um, as you can see I also bought some magnets because for some absurd reason I collect magnets. I also bought these pocket storage plastic thingies that they had there. I haven't really used them yet, but I just thought that they would be a great idea because as you can see, you can store some stuff in it and put them into a binder. And I'm all about putting things in binders. So you get five in a little collection there. And I think it was $5.99. There you go, $5.99 for five little pocket storage things. So I will use them at some point. I'm trying to get organised this year. And these were, I thought, were a good buy. And they're good quality plastic. And some are long and some are short. So I'm sure I'll find things to fill them up with. And yes, here is another magnet. Don't wait for opportunities created. Love it. I said to myself at the beginning of this year, do not buy any more stamps. You have got way too many stamps. Um, I must have forgotten that little resolution I made this year because I bought some stamps. Oops. Does anyone else have a problem with stamps? They just keep accumulating for some reason for me. But I love these ones and I thought they were a good buy, $5 for some of these lovely little sayings. And I may add, I've already used some of these. Yay! And these ones here, too cool for school. Ah, oh, how can you not buy that? Because I'm soon going to be working on school layouts, uh, kindergarten school layouts and that. And I just thought, yes, these are going to be perfect. So I had to buy them. Honestly, I really, really had to buy them. Look how cool they are. I love the little glasses. I can use that for other stuff other than just school layouts. And that cute little seal mini stamp, $2. So I also bought this little present one, which I thought would be great for birthdays or Christmas. I also got these little stone thingies. I'm not sure what I'm going to use them for. They were like $6. But I thought I do a lot of mixed media and I might do them on a beachy layout or I might use them for something. I thought it's always handy to have them in my stash. So, couldn't resist. I also saw these Casercraft gold metallic paints and silver metallic paint. And since I don't have gold or silver metallic paints in my stash, I thought it would be a good addition to my little collection of uh, paints. And I thought I'd add this pigment liner pen to my collection because for some reason when I want to do some journaling, I can never find my pens. And I could not resist this 12 by 12 stencil uh, full of stars. And I thought, wow, for $5, what a great price. So into my little basket it went. Absolutely love that. It's just called stars. I didn't go too crazy on the stencils. I just got this little, this mini grunge film one, which I thought would be great for some boyish layouts and then I couldn't resist getting the raindrop one which I'll show you in a minute. There you go and I thought that would be use, useful in my stash. And as for car, for paper I only bought these four glitter card stocks that's what they were called and I just love them. I think they were four for ten dollars. Now confession time I'm not going to be buying any paper this year except for cardstock because I've got lots of patterned paper. But this, my friends, is not paper. They are stickers. Okay? Stickers. Stickers are different to papers. 
my only wish is that I had a uh, case of craft DFO or any case of craft shop right next to me. But I guess I've got a three, four hour drive if I ever want to go to case of craft again. But since I have family down that way, I will be making maybe a few more trips a year to Canberra. It is really worth going and as far as I'm concerned, Kaiser Craft is Australian and I love to support the small Australian scrapbooking industry. So I'm really happy to, to make my way down to Canberra and visit Kaiser Craft and get bits and pieces when I need it. And I love all these 12 by 12 sticker collections that I bought. They're just absolutely beautiful. And I resisted buying paper because I have got enough paper here in my stash to last me for a couple of years, I think. But my promise to myself is that once I use up quite a lot of my stash, I can then go and get a few of the newer ones. But I just got way too much paper, which I think most of us have. So thank you for watching. I'm getting to the end of my haul. And until next time, stay safe.